From our other top story tonight, MSU announcing sweeping security changes on campus. It includes badge access to buildings along with locks on classrooms and more cameras. Mara McDonald, downtown tonight. That's just the start, Mara. Devin, that's right. The university actually has an RFP out for a new state of the art security system, which would include centralized video monitoring. And here's the key part of that in real time. Some of these changes are going to take time, but the first part of this requiring students to use their key card to access educational buildings after 6 p.m. That's set to go into practice by March 13th. And I wish it did not have to be that way, but I'm glad they're putting in more security measures. Installing more cameras and locks on classroom doors is a process. That will take time. Um, you know, it will take time. Supply chain, we are heavily reliant upon that installation, things of that nature. Uh, but we will begin to do that as soon as the equipment arrives. The university also wants a new state of the art security system for campus, which would have real time centralized monitoring of cameras across campus. It also wants students to undergo active shooter training. Local force security expert Darnell Blackburn, who is a former MSU police officer, says all of these changes make a difference, but the most impactful the active shooter training um, because it has to be you know if, if somebody wants to do something like this it takes a lot to stop them so the best thing we can do is just plan and prepare back here live the university is hopeful that it will have locks on those classroom doors by the fall semester we're live downtown i'm mara mcdonald local yeah, four you got it all right mara